My name is Ilie and I'm representing a small non-profit organization. We are called People of 2050 and we are based in Copenhagen, Denmark. And uh, I have some questions for you, but maybe before we ask the questions, uh, if you want to tell us who you are and what you are doing. Yeah, well, I'm Scott Shearlaw. I'm a dairy farmer from southwest Scotland. Um, I farm 600 acres, um, I have 400 milking cows, uh, and I produce 3 million litres of milk every year. Uh, and that milk gets used in the chocolate and some of Nestle's biggest brands like Kit Kat and Yorkie. Well, so I guess my first question for you would be, um, what can youth yeah, and we, young people, the, the future of the planet, what can we do to, to raise awareness about climate change, in your opinion? I, I think young people, um, they're obviously the future, and uh, I think the biggest thing young people can do, or, and, and I speak about this from a, from a food perspective, because that's the industry I'm in, is to, to eat local food, um, to be conscientious about the carbon footprint of the food, the year. Um, and th the biggest thing is really to eat locally. Um, and in, in the UK we're really good at, at producing meat and dairy and I think that's absolutely fine for, for meat and dairy to be a, a large part of, of people's diets in the UK and, and across Europe. Hmm. Interesting. All right. So speaking from the food industry or from the food perspective, when we discuss about climate change, many people get quite anxious or even depressed thinking about this topic and um, we are trying to combine arts or use arts in order to communicate about these topics to make it more attractive to make it more entertaining to make it more more, more interesting for the for the people to speak about climate change so in your opinion what do you think we could do to combine arts with climate science uh, when speaking about the food industry in order to promote a more sustainable diet amongst youth well, I'm no expert in the arts, but yeah. um, I think if you want to communicate with young people, social media is probably the way to do it. Social media is important, yeah. All right. Thank you so much.